I'm walking into my classroom for the first time this year. It looks a little sparse and messy. I guess today and tomorrow I will clean it, organize it, and decorate it. And then, on Thursday, the students arrive, breathing life into this old building. They're putting their trust in me, in us, to prepare them for college, career, and citizenship. But we have let them down. You see, the United States is ranked 25th and 24th, respectively, in the math and sciences, according to the Program for International Student Assessment. And I know we can do better, because we are doing better here in Coachella. Besides being the home of the annual music festival, Coachella is home to more than 40,000 people, 97% of whom are Hispanic, 65% of their households bring in less than 50,000 a year, and the primary employers are the farms and hotel industry. Our students are a statistical anomaly because with the help of a website I developed called Chem in 10, we have already raised their chemistry scores an average of 10 points. Chem in 10 teaches high school and AP chemistry in 10 minute easy to understand interactive video lessons. Students log in, watch a video, and then take an online quiz. But more than that, Chem in 10 offers the mentorship to ensure students excel in the hard sciences. Students get their questions answered in our online forum and in our online classroom. Why chemistry? 25 to 60 percent of college students fail chemistry and as a result switch to majors outside of the STEM fields. STEM refers to science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. A 2011 New York Times article cited studies claiming that 40 to 60 percent of entering college students planning engineering and science majors end up switching to other subjects. Our colleges only graduate 9.2 percent in the STEM fields. Why? They find the hard sciences just too hard. We are losing students at an alarming rate. Yet, if the United States is to maintain its historic preeminence in the STEM fields, then we must produce approximately one million more workers in those fields over the next decade than we are producing now. With Chem in 10, I'm seeking to replicate our success with students across the country and around the globe. We are also planning to launch Physics in 10 and Math in 10, revolutionizing the way students learn the hard sciences. You see, I have a dream of making the hard sciences accessible to all students, one student at a time. But I can't do it alone. That's why I'm asking for your help. Chem in 10 needs your financial support to achieve our vision of providing students with the best possible math and science education. With your help, we can reach out to the greatest number of students and provide them the tools to succeed in the math and sciences. With your help, we can improve our website to provide the best possible interface for our students. With your help, we can make iPhone and iPad apps to reach out to a wider audience. With your help, we can flood our workforce with individuals highly qualified in math and science and regain America's standing as the seat of innovation. Help us. Go to www.indiegogo.com forward slash chem and 10 and give generously. Our students are counting on us.